Hello everyone. Hello. My name is Yuta Fujimoto and I'm from Toyohashi and I am a freshman at Chiyo University. This is kind of London. I have a question for you all. Do you think that education that people can receive from anywhere is necessary? Okay, thank you. I will tell you why I asked the question. I had trouble getting along with people when I was a junior high school student. And by the way, while I was a junior high school student, I belonged to the baseball team and I had a baseball practice four days a week. I was good at playing baseball. I was very, very good at playing baseball. So, and I even got a scholarship. However, because of my bad school record, I was not able to enter the high school that I wanted to go to. After that, I found a high school in Kanagawa where I could continue playing baseball. However, when I took classes, I was I I wouldn't I couldn't understand the uh, I couldn't understand at the level I was expected as a high school student. As a result, after I graduated the high school, I ended up studying for the university entrance exams for another two years. Looking back, if I had instead attended classes from home when I was 15, I wouldn't have experienced these things. Therefore, I want to share my idea of what I call unusual space education. Currently, many students around the world cannot attend their classes from whenever they are. I personally experienced this uh, when I was not able to receive my school record because I was frequently absent from my school. Some people may think that club schools or free schools can be alternatives. However, these alternative schools are expensive for students and there are very few of them in the countryside. I think education is a very important resource in order for societies to develop. So, we have to change our learning environment immediately. Then, I want to refer to what I think the most important, most important goal in sustainable development goals. According to the sustainable, sustainable development goal for target 4.1, by 2030, ensure that all girls and boys complete free, equitable, and quality primary and secondary education, leading to relevant and effective learning outcomes. So, please have a look at the slide. Three billion. Do you know what this number represents? Nobody? This number represents that there are about 3 billion people who are not well educated because there are not enough schools around the world.
This is not only a problem in developing countries, but also in developed countries as well. As mentioned before, I was not well educated when I was a junior high school student. So, we have to change learning environment immediately. So, in order to accomplish my idea and sustainable development goal, I want to use COSAL. COSAL is a general term for leading edge technologies, such as VR, AR, and ML. These days, due to COVID-19, most students are taking their online classes by using Zoom. However, this is not a good educational environment for students. In recent years, artificial intelligence has been dramatically changing our world. As a result, people need to be able to express their individuality more clearly in order to stand out from artificial intelligence. If people can express their individuality, more and more people will be playing an active part in society. Therefore, we have to accomplish unusual space education and create a learning environment for students uh, where so where students can learn subjects which, are which will be necessary for future work from anywhere by using closer technologies. My speech will end here. Thank you for listening.